magic and mineral makeup. Look, they're talking about bare minerals. Yay, I love bare minerals. I do not love this serum though. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Hello, creepy friends. Welcome to Slam the Bobs. Welcome to monthly boxes again. We have in our hands the Look Fantastic April box. There were several teasers held everywhere. I have not looked at any one of them. The only thing I do know is that again, they have supplied us with this lovely Elle magazine that I don't read. Look at that lovely colouring. They are really putting more effort into some of these lovely box designs recently. I am loving this. I think it's so pretty. Look, you actually do want to use that as well. It's not like with the black cover, with the white. You actually want to put something in this box and use it. I've said before, mainly with me, especially around Christmas time, I tend to keep these and like put Christmas gifts in them. So they're actually really reusable as well. This feels like a really heavy box. I have, as I said, no idea what's in it. I'm just gonna rip the lid off and get going. I am in a tiny bit of a rush because people are coming home in the next 10 minutes. So here is our lovely box. Here is the pink paper. Hashtag beauty box. Hey, oh, look, I ripped it off. Oh, receive an exclusive 20% of living nature. Look at that. And here are all the gifts. I will let you look before I do. Oh no. We've got another effervescent vitamin challenge. Oh no, we're gonna leave that till last because I'm actually quite afraid of it. <laughs> Do you remember the last one? <laughs> Start with this. It would be traditional if I did not drop something. This is Bloom and Blossom Bath and Shower Gel. I can see it right there. Free from parabens, sulfates and synthetic fragrance, this shower will leave your skin feeling beautiful and looking healthy. Infused with organic cucumber extracts and vitamin E, the gel will nourish your skin and wash away dirt, oil and impurities. It also is completely safe to use throughout pregnancy, motherhood due to its natural and safe ingredients. How lovely. I have hair in my nose. I slept on a plait and now my hair is kind of frizzy but like going everywhere. It was because my hair wasn't dry enough last night. Why do I always forget the seal? Oh! It smells quite nice. Going in the bathroom. Can't say much about a bath and a shower gel, can you, I guess? The next thing I have is Elemis. Elemis is super, super expensive, everyone. If you don't know. And there is actually an Elemis TSV coming up on QVC, so that's one to watch out for. This is British Botanical Hand and Nail Butter. Lovely. What smell is it? Body soothing. Okay, I'm always in the market for a new hand cream. At the minute, I'm using Lush's Handy Guru Goo, which I've been enjoying. Let's give this a go. I have actually wanted to try the Elemis hand creams for a while because they have really good reputations. This is lovely and thick and nice. Let me tell you that off the bat. Wow. I like it and I like the fact that it feels thick on skin because I don't like a loose hand cream. I always worry that that is not going to really hydrate my skin. Obviously, being a manual worker, I use my handy pandies a lot. Skin softening hand butter with Buer. I don't know what that word says, Paula Mains for the hands, there you go. Uh, Elemis Skin Cream. I know that's going to be quite expensive, but on the other hand, it's, it's one of those things that you should uh, invest in because it's a good product, go for it. Next thing I have here is Rituals. And Rituals Miracle Scrub Ultra Softening Hand Scrub. This should be good for dry skin hands that I normally have. A scrub. I've never used a hand scrub before. It's a lot just like an exfoliator, I guess. Try a little tip on that. Wow. Scrubby, 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 scrub, scrub, scrub. Oh my god, that's a scrub. That's definitely a scrub. This exfoliating scrub from Rituals is infused with nourishing oils which deeply condition and nourish to leave behind healthy and glowing skin. A delicate scent of gin ginseng will leave you smelling beautiful. Whilst Jinko Biloba symbolises life and strength in Japanese culture, giving you a boost of confidence with energy when you need it most. It sounds very nice. It is actually quite a floral smell. I do, I'm absolutely inspired by Japan and Japanese like geisha culture and uh, Harajuku. There's a word I'm looking for, kawaii, what is it? Lolita is another style. I'm trying to think of a particular Japanese style that I can't quite remember. I'm going to have to put it down here once I've actually remembered it. I've never tried a hand scrub before, but I think this will be a good idea and it will certainly help, certainly all the dryness I get around here. And I also had a big patch of dry skin right here that I was playing with at work yesterday. Always seems to be that part by the wedding fingers. I'm not sure why. Oh, I've got more products than I thought I have. Oh, this will not be used by me. This is, we've had this before, this is Tanworks Tan Maintainer uh, to maintain a tan if you've been on holiday. I don't know if it's necessarily for uh, 
like a fake tan I don't think last time we got this I actually gave it to my mum who'd just been on holiday and she really enjoyed it so this will probably be going to her and she will keep this for her holiday in September and use it then by me I don't tan I like being pale white so this is not a product for me but thank you for the gift anyway the next thing I have is Briogeo don't despair repair deep conditioning mask I actually really needed this last week when my skin broke out due to moxicillin. Yay! Infused with argan, avocado, roseship and sweet almond oils alongside vitamins A, B5, D and E. This mask from organic band Briogeo. Am I saying that right? Will leave your hair feeling... Oh, it's hair! Feeling super soft and replenished. The unique blend of ingredients promotes healthy looking hair and shine. Improves its elasticity and strength whilst giving you revitalised and more radiant hair. I thought this was a face mask. Duh me! After shampooing massage into the hair from root to tip, I didn't think you should put conditioners into the root, so I would probably only do it from about the mid lengths, just my call there. For even deeper conditioning, cover the hair in a plastic cap to retain moisture while sitting under the dryer for 20 minutes. Because you're really going to hold the hair dry for 20 minutes. I know, I'm being pedantic. I know they mean the actual hair conditioners. My hair has improved a lot recently. I changed my shampoo from the lush ones I was using and I'm using something else. I'm not going to tell you what it is. And I also invested back in Redken's Extreme Conditioner, which has really been helping out a lot. I've still got quite a few split ends. And yes, I know I just need to go to the blooming hairdressers and I don't want to. So this will be put in my... My bathroom and the next time I deep condition or maybe the next time I just wash my hair I will give it a go. The two products left first second penultimate is this Balance Me Super Toning Body Polish which is a body exfoliator. Balance Me are something that look fantastic to do regularly. They often give us treats from this. This exfoliant from natural brand Balance Me is the ultimate skin treat in skincare luxury. That was a mouthful. Ground walnut spheres to help exfoliate away dead skin cells and product build up to reveal smooth and glowing skin. The inclusion of blackberry leaf helps to boost the production of collagen and help and encourage cell renewal for soft skin that looks as healthy as it feels. I'm not really one for using body polishes. Uh, let's give it a smell. Seal, seal, seal. Doesn't want to come off. Don't try that at home because you're really not meant to use your teeth for that kind of thing. It's kind of a bit toilet cleanery, I'll be really honest. Uh, let's try it on this hand because I put the hand so later on this one. Definitely quite toilet cleanery, no offence, Balance Me. It seems quite nice and I love the fact that Balance Me are quite naturally occurring brand. They're 99% natural according to this. I do love that about them. Don't know if it's something I personally use, just my call. The last thing we have I'm quite afraid of. This is My Vitamins Effervescent vitamin pills do you remember the what we went through with the orange one i'm quite afraid so these are lemon flavored tablets and yes we're going to try them right now got the glass of water and we've got the chopstick again i'm death defyingly afraid of doing this really afraid i don't want to do it but i'm only doing it for you guys oh i think the lemon ones were the ones they gave us last time you know and they horrified my taste buds and I have no other drink right now to take the taste away I should have bought some cherry coke up with me okay right I'm so scared I do have polos actually I guess I could put a polo in my mouth if it does taste bad seems to be taking forever to like effervesce it's like dancing now come on come on any time today I don't have all day to wait for you. Okay, that's just about done. I tried to fill this up. I think it normally tells you to do what, like 200 mil amount? 200 mil glass. So that's got to be about 200 mils or so, I think. <sighs> I'm more nervous about this one than the orange one because I remember this one. I think they gave us this last time and it was blooming awful. Here's a nice little cheers. Wish me luck. <sighs> I'm so scared. I hate doing these, so I only do them for you. It tastes of nothing. Literally nothing. Now I'm getting a bitterness. It's not lemony at all. It doesn't even resemble lemon. Like, it does not resemble anything lemon that I have ever tried. It does not resemble a lemon bonbon that I've got down here. It does not resemble 
a nice sour lemon sweet. It resembles lemon in no way, shape or form at all. It's not particularly pleasant though in saying that, like, you know if you've had a soluble paracetamol, you kind of get that aftertaste in the back of your mouth. Not as horrifying as I remember and not as horrifying as that collagen drink we had uh, a couple of months back. Quite a few months back now, that's got to be nearly a year ago. We had that collagen drink, that the collagen drinks that are really expensive, they supplied us with them and that was violently horrible. Like, really, it was one of the worst things I've ever had. It's okay, I could drink that and be okay. The orange one did taste better, and I'm sure last time, and I don't think it made it to air, it might have been a look fantastic that I didn't actually record. It was more awful, more disgusting, and I remember taking it, drinking it, and going Bleh! afterwards. It, I didn't spew, but I, like the taste was so bad. It's probably a full-size box of these as well, I should say. Oh, look, Rituals has the Sakura collection, look. That's so pretty. Sakura is cherry blossom in Japanese and it's also the character's name in card captors, which I adore. I love card captors. I'm just now using this as like a little pokey wand. Trying to find the effervescent lemon tablets. They're not here. They're not in the guide. No, they're not in our guide at all, these things. So I can only read to you what's in here. Not to be used as a substitute for a balanced diet. Keep it out of reach of children. Uh, duh. Yeah, so one tablet a day, 200 millilitres of water, and then down this like a champ. It's not that bad. Oh, I shouldn't have said like a champ. I'm now getting horrible memories of kneeling and taking it like a champ in the Walking Dead finale. Keep a watch out for my Walking Dead finale video. That's coming. I normally don't do Walking Dead, but I had to do this one. So yet again, I am met with fear by the drink, and it's really not that bad. Good to them to supply these because I think my vitamins are actually quite expensive to buy so I'm going to put the price of them down here just to let you know how much this 20 pill pot would be. Chin chin everyone. And that unfortunately is the end of our Look Fantastic Beauty Box. That is the end of everything this month. We've got quite a few things I think I'm going to enjoy, particularly the Elemis Hand Cream and the Briogeo and this uh, bath and shower gel. All of these just tend to go in the bathroom and just wait for me to use them, apart from the hand cream. That may actually go in my handbag because it's so nice and delicately small. Thank you for being here and enjoying this or enduring watching this lovely video with me. I try to keep it nice and short and sweet because I think too long and people don't tend to like them. Probably not the best one I think look fantastic ever given us. Uh, the continuation of L seems to be a theme now as well. They've given us, I think this is about the third or fourth month with this. It's a really good buy. It's a really good thing to get when you think it's like £4.10 on its own. Not quite something I would enjoy. Give us Kerrang and I'll love you forever. Still obviously have the Birch and the Gossy Box still glossy box still to come and normal monthlies but that is it for look fantastic i'll be back next month for the may look fantastic which i'm expecting it's starting going to start to get more tanny and more summery as the time goes on who knows i don't know if you would like to subscribe it is down here if you would like to tell me how you got on with these products please do share if you'd like to follow instagram or twitter it's also down here i will see everybody again for another beauty thunderbirds anything whatever the hell i want to talk about video because that's what i do on slams and bobs bye everyone